Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm setting up the next four weeks for July. I did the first week when I set up for the whole month, so check out that video if you want to see how it turned out. I am really loving the strawberry theme. It's so fun and simple and there are so many ways to make every page different. I'm still using my bullet journal as just a journal right now and using a daily planner to keep track of my daily tasks, but I'm missing being in my bullet journal every day. When I was keeping my tasks in it, I would carry it around the house with me and take it everywhere I went. It was nice because it felt like it was truly worth all the effort it takes to make these spreads when I was using it all day long. Now I only open it once a day and that's just to fill everything out, like my habit tracker and my mood tracker. I'm leaning towards having three journals, my reading journal, my daily journal to write my thoughts, and a regular bullet journal for tasks, projects, content, and all the other daily stuff that I need to write down. I'm thinking the daily journal will be just a journal that goes day to day and not a theme per month. I don't know. I'm still trying to figure that out, but I will definitely keep you guys posted. I would love to be the kind of person that just has everything all in one journal, but for some reason my brain likes to keep everything separated. Anyway, back to what I'm doing here. I had so much fun creating these weeklies. Most of these I've never done before and I love the way they turned out. I'm using all the same supplies that I used for my monthly spreads and I'll have everything linked down in the description box below. My camera cut off while I was making this spread and I didn't realize it until I was done. 
Thankfully, this was the simplest one and you guys didn't miss much. This is the last weekly spread for July. I'm not sure which one is my favorite, but this one is pretty close. I am a sucker for a good vertical layout. Let me know which one your favorite is in the comments below. Alright, so that is it for this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I hope to see you in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!